Welcome to the home stretch. Now all we have to do is tweak a couple of things and we can test it. Head to login client and change process complete Dell and login client from internal to public. And also head to process and change packet reader data to buffer. And head over to queries and make sure all of them copy always. Okay. Now let's make our dummy project. One moment. Okay, let's try that again. Let's make our dummy project. There we go. Now, let's add a button, some stuff, simulate something you would have in your program, and that's good enough. Now, uh, add a reference, solution, projects, and logsys. Now, go down to program and add new login form, new form one. And include logsys. So instead of showing our form, it'll show our login form, and it'll only show form one when the login is successful. Now so let's build everything. Okay, now let's try it out. Let's run our server, and if you can't run multiple instances like if you're using the Express Edition of Visual Studio, just open the path to your project and go to bin and debug and run it from there. And our login form is shown. Let's attempt to log in and see what happens. And as you can see, the username password combo does not match records. So now let's register. Our password checking works. Let's register. Registration successful. You may now log in. Welcome, username, and our form is now shown. Now let's do a review of everything we did so far. We created our SQL class to um, maintain our connections and get query to so we don't have to hard code any SQL queries into our programs. We created, well we did this in a past tutorial, we created our listener and we have our headers and our login client well, this is the client that we use, or well, our little wrapper, for our socket when it's accepted. And in login system, we created our login client, which handles both logging in and registering. And then we also created our dummy project, and we Um, use this as our testing ground and seem to work pretty well. And what? Well, oops. That's about it for a simple login server in C Sharp. If you have any other questions, leave a comment, PM, whatever. Let me know what's up. Let me know if you liked it or not. And I'll see you next time. Peace.